My name is Melissa Farrick, and I've been making independent albums for 27 years now. I'm an associate professor at Berklee College of Music. What do you find to be the hardest thing to achieve as a storyteller, whether it's, you know, telling a story on stage like you're going to do this evening or as a songwriter? Staying in the moment, not thinking while I'm performing too much. There's like a real fine line of being conscious and unconscious in performance. Uh, so for me, as a performer, uh, I do think some people have like a bit of a gift in performing, and um, I've been blessed with that gift. So I, I am able to get out of my own way pretty quickly. So I find that if I get in trouble when I'm telling a story or when I'm playing a show, it's because I'm thinking about myself. So <laughs> I have to remember to, to stay open to change. Um, so allowing the, cho the story to really go where it wants to, but also be uh, involved as my human enough to, to also kind of mold it and, and shape it and get it back on track. So. And is this the first time that you're telling a story like this as a not part of your musical act? Yes, this is the first time I've ever just told the story. So How are you feeling? I'm nervous. Yeah, I'm nervous. It's different. I just hope to be able to look out and see people smiling and laugh a couple times. That's that's like such a great feeling as a performer because you're enabling people to relax. That's what makes a good show, even when I'm playing music. If, if people are able to forget about their own lives, even if it's just for a brief moment, um, that's, a, that's something I'm able to give them. So 